so many people turned out to support the Brunig family tonight that you could barely hear the loudspeakers cut through this crowd of family and friends. 21 year old David DJ Brunig is still missing, but not forgotten. You're all holding out hope. We're all holding out hope that they find him. A cold night on Portland's Western Promenade didn't keep hundreds from turning out for the Maine Maritime Academy student and Westbrook graduate. He was an athlete in, in Westbrook and really um, well respected and uh, a very respectful young man. Uh, and, and so uh, obviously, you can see with all these people here, he, uh, he, was, he was well liked and uh, the whole family is, is, is much, very much liked in the Westbrook community. Brunig was seen last Friday on North Main Avenue in Orono. He hasn't been seen or heard from since. Maine game wardens haven't stopped searching the area for him, but say this is now a recovery effort. For days, neighbors have been reaching out to the Brunig family. We care and that we're with them and anything we can do to help. And like I said, just keep hope alive. I'd like to thank everybody for coming and all the support. And uh, it's overwhelming how many people love our family. Organizers were prepared for a more intimate gathering, but quickly learned how many people planned to turn out to show their support. This is amazing. We were going to do maybe 50 candles, and then we said, Jackie said we had to do about 300. And, and there's, I don't know, there's well more, more, well more than 300 people here tonight. It's been a long week for everyone attending tonight, but they say they will be here for the Brunig family for as long as it takes. In Portland, Courtney Sturgeon, WMTW News 8.